Uh oh. I caught by one of these uh, RC traps. <laughs> What's up guys, Eric, I've got the Arma Creighton 8S EXB. Uh, this is something new. Um, first of all, huge uh, shout out to Mitchell and Avery Looper from M2C Racing for basically sponsoring this truck and the build. Um, it's a complete ground up uh, M2C build and also with the, eight, with the uh, new uh, 8S EXB components. First shot on the inside here, of course it's got the M2C chassis, uh, all the braces, the motor mounts, uh, the new uh, uh, chassis brace um, rod ends right there. Uh, it's got the M2C shocks on it, the 7 millimeter shocks with the 775 rod ends, and also the uh, M2C drive shafts. So it's completely uh, beef caked all the way out from uh, from the ground up. Um, it, it does have the Hobby Star 840KV in it, uh, 56112. Uh, it's got Saga Racing uh, Steel 3434 gearing in it with the Saga Racing Steel Spur gears. They're excellent gears um, and they hold up really good, of course, with the Max 5 ESC Punch 5. And then the diffs, I'm running um, uh, 1 million in the front, 20 million center, and 500 in the rear. I didn't have any uh, 500k diff fluid, it's really hard to find right now, so I just did a mixture of 100,000 and 1 million, kind of a 50 50 mixture to come up with uh, as close to 500 as I could. These M2C drive shafts uh, should be on the website in the next uh, couple of weeks or so. Uh, they're just beautiful uh, drive shafts with a black oxide finish. And they, uh, and they really hold up and they're going to be minus one millimeter from a stock drive shaft which means they'll be a millimeter shorter uh, to kind of prevent any kind of cup jamming uh, if you have any kind of severe arm flex and stuff like that uh, which which will cause your drive shaft to bend and again these are uh, thicker in the middle and then taper down to the ends and are made from a hardened steel all right guys we're gonna give this baby a quick run and uh, we'll see what's up <laughs> Oh, that was close. 
Caught by one of these uh, RC traps. Just killed a tire. <laughs> There's one EXP tire down for the count. That's one thing, guys. These tires just don't like the big power. So that's what happens. Talk about ascend it and a blind landing. She's back here in the jungle. Guys, that's gonna be it. It's LVC. <laughs> She's a complete tank. <sighs> Everything on this baby still looks good. The chassis scraped up, it's still straight. Drive shafts still look perfectly straight. Shocks look good in the back there. We'll check the front. May not be catching this on the camera, but everything looks good. Uh, some of these construction sites I've been going to were super, uh, super rough and unpredictable <laughs> and just launching off in them big hills and stuff. You have no idea what you're going to encounter when you hit the bottom. But uh, she definitely took some hard hits and rolls and uh, tumbles and just kept on ticking. So, so uh, again, big shout out and thank you to Arma Horizon Hobby and, uh, and M2C Racing for all the upgrades. And uh, we'll get her out again soon. I've got the new Arma Outcast 8S as well, uh, getting ready to put some electronics in it. So you guys be looking out for that soon. All right, guys, until next time, RC Dude 81. Peace out.